Hi everyone, Syndra here. Welcome back to Echoes of Etheria. As we continue on in the Wamalas Swamp. I don't know why, I like the name. <laughs> and this is a pretty big area here, not separated like the jungle was. We had a bunch of small well, not small, but you know, smaller areas, you know, taking this path and then this path. You know, this room and then this room. This one's not as uh, segmented. Hi. You look angry. I expected that to be Fishman, to be honest. Shoot the one in the back. Okay. Soha can't hit that one. So, swing at the front. Maybe Lucian can finish this off. Yep! Alright, that's one down. Bleed! Don't want to be bleeding. Shoot the one in the back again! This one's dead. You know what Soha doesn't have? He doesn't have a way to cure status effects. Yet. Blood Saber! Well, we can split that between the other two. Get a little bit of HP back. All right, want to use dead searing slash. And again, that would be smooth if I didn't have a super old computer. <laughs> so sorry for the little delays and not being able to show this game off in all of its how it should look. Level up. Level 11. Fulgurite shards. Toss a concoction under the enemy animal army that increases lightning damage can inflict shock. There you go, if you want to go the lightning route. So how reaches level 11? Bloodlust. A single ally goes into a blood rage. They become immensely strong and fast and attacks drain HP. But they rapidly lose HP over time. How much? <laughs> Because I could send Lucian into a into bloodlust. Minus cooldown time, more strength buff. Have him swing for the fences and just try to keep him healed. <laughs> Via a combination of vampiric touch, blood saber, and nurture. <laughs> I like that. I like that idea. I might just might just do that. I'll need more uh another slot to really really try that out though and that's just one path of Soha this is like I can't I can't say enough how awesome it is that there are many skills to choose from and that you get these this variation in the characters like I'm going this whole blood tap route with Soha but you don't have to do that. You could go the pure magic casting route and spec her for that. Or you could even be balanced and take a combination of the two. You know, kind of what I have now. I have a little more balance. Or at least I did when I had the... Uh... What's the name of that move? The, uh... the mind bend bender on. Blood tap. Just short. Ice blade. Yeah, slow down for me. Ugh, poison. And you're done. It's really cool that you get those options. Paradox Fragment. Let's head up here. Alright, let's do this again. Shoot the one in the back. Attack. And Ice Blade. You're dead. Eh, bleed. Kill the one in the back. 
And... What, Saber? You're dead, Searing Slash. And that's that. Good stuff. Oh, here's quite the mix. Shoot the dragonfly in the back. That's one down. <laughs> Next, hit you. There goes one of the fishmen, and then here comes the damage. And not as much as I thought. There goes another one. Really glad. Wow. Really glad we have that sniper rifle. It's great against these flying enemies. Great just do single target. Well, not even single target. It's just great to do. A lot of damage in one shot. Um, Blood Saber. I splayed you. Ah. Died from that. Awesome. I have all this TP, and other than Lucia using his moves, we really don't use that much in a regular battle. Hmm. And so close! First aid, cleansing herbs. You, you are Lucian's level. <laughs> oh, this fight again. Alright. Blood Saber. Now you'll die by the Blood Tap. So I'm gonna Ice Blade. Or you should die by the Blood Tap anyway. Like so. <laughs> this is where Wide Swing would really come in handy. Um, you know what? Why not? Empiric touch. Because I can't. Unfortunately, Lucian's gonna kill whatever he swings at. Unless I just base it. Nope. So I really don't get the vampiric touch on them. Again, against these weaker enemies, it's not gonna be that useful. But I'm planning for tougher enemies. That may take a while to take down, you know, in particular a boss. And then having, you know, stacking blood tap on it. Level 12 for Lucian. Berserker Rush. Go into an aggressive adrenaline rush. Increases strength and speed, but decreases defenses. Ha <laughs> ha. Not exactly what I want for my tank right now, but... I will keep Berserker Rush in mind. Press the attack. Critical hits from all allies generate extra TP. Hmm, if you could get a lot of critical hits going somehow. Like, find ways to increase critical, uh, critical chance and then use press the attack, you could get a lot out of that. Plus be doing just a ton of damage from critical hits. A diamond fragment. Go over here. Leather. Um, sapphire fragment. Those both lead the same place. Oh, there's another path. I'm not done exploring this. Broccoli of Wisdom. <laughs> Which raises wisdom by five. That one's, you know, they're all kind of self explanatory. I still don't see a way to get to those treasure chests. 
that we left behind in the other area. Like, I don't see, like, a way down here or anything. There is that house that I am going to explore. Try to take another look around. like that's it. Except for you and the treasure chest down there. <laughs> Alright, again. Change it up a little bit. You're dead. I a little too fast too, but Searing Slash Yeah, and he's bleeding twice. When the when those start to stack, you take a lot of damage. Like the bleed uh, bleed, blood tap, poison. Hey, a sapphire fragment, awesome. When those things start to start to stack. Iron, there's an exploration point. Alright, I want to check out the house before we move on. A rainbow fragment. Huh. There's an amber fragment. We have the key, so we can unlock this. Hey, an anvil! We have iron now, but... Rejuvenating mist. Neat. Glad I checked that. Aha! This leads to the treasure chest, don't they? Iron? Yeah! There we go! Good, we found it! Blade. Probably overkill. Yeah, those hurt! <laughs> I don't have to worry about poison or any of that. Blood Saber! Lucy can have a little bit of that HP. Goodbye! Really happy with Searing Slash. Just out of curiosity, scan. How much can I get out of Ice Blade now? A little bit more. Again, be useful against bosses. You're just stacking everything on a boss. Level 12 for Ingrid. Poison Rain. Launch a 3x3 area of effect attack with poison nails. Enemies will be inflicted with the poison that damages over time. I like that. Covering Shot. Counter enemy melee attacks to any row or behind her current row. Counter enemy melee attacks to any row. Row at or behind her current row. Okay, so she gives covering fire. Soha reaches level 12. Siphon energy. Absorb the gathered energy from enemy channeled attacks and gain TP. Ooh. Like that. Soul Stealer. If an enemy is killed by Soha's drains or is inflicted with blood tap, Soha grows stronger for the battle. Stacks up to five times. I like that. <laughs> I like that a lot. <laughs>
considering we want to inflict a bunch of blood tap. I understand why they limited the stacking as well. <laughs> the question is how much stronger for the battle. That will be the... That'll be the key. See, and this is lowering the TP cost as well. So this would be even more expensive. Minus cooldown time plus TP uh, stolen. That's awesome. Just flat out steal TP. I am liking a lot of Soha's attacks. It's my kind, my kind of character. To to debuff the enemy and buff yourselves at the same time. I like having Gift of Life on, it's just the, you know, panic button. I might as well put the points there for now. Um, so many choices, so many good ones. <laughs> Instead of the permafrost crystals, I'm gonna go with the poison rain. More poison with an exclamation mark. <laughs> Yeah, poisoning an enemy could be very useful. We'll go with that for now. Also, I would like to have all gun attacks, well, all gun attacks who are portion of enemy's armor. I like that. Ingrid would be the one to use a healing item as, you know, just in case, but I want to give Covering Shot a try. Because if I can get Ingrid some additional attacks, she does a lot of damage with that sniper rifle. That could be really useful. Grapes of Dexterity, Rainbow Fragment, 160, 176 Gold, and a Carrot of Strength. I think that gives us a wide variety of stat boosting items. I think one to each stat now. Salmon of Health, Carrot of Strength, Onion of Vitality, Grapes of Dex, uh, Broccoli of Wisdom. I think we're missing one. HP Strength, Vitality, Dex. We don't have one for Agility, do we? And we have one for Dex. We don't have one for Agility yet. I don't think we have one for Int either, do we? No. Okay. I like those though. D the different foods. <laughs> what does what makes those foods special? Like what makes these grapes give you extra Dex other than you know regular grapes? What? <laughs> Did they grow really fast? I mean, <laughs> what? What makes them grapes of dexterity? Got any crazy theories? Let me know. Okay, I think we're... I think we're through with this. Let's head to the next area. World map? New lore. Uh... Kirei. Rebellion Hideout, El Saga Caverns. Hi. I don't know, female or male, what do you think? I'm thinking female? <laughs> I can't do, they're like, uh, cat people? Wolf, maybe? I don't have a voice for that. I'm sorry. <laughs> are all the are all the civilians evacuated? Every last one of them. They're taking the underground river to the jungle hideout. And the supplies? Still working on that. One last shipment and we'll be finished. Still no word from the tide reavers, huh? Sorry, Lady Kirei. I was right. Scouts have reported that the Viridian army has completely wiped them out. I should have seen this coming! Round up all this stuff! Iskander is waiting for us at the jungle hideout! At least we'll be safe for a little longer. Intruders! Scramble to the boats! Hurry! That's bad. What? 
Who are you? They're all... Man, this one guy took them all out. Dead. What's up, assassin? Sorry about that. How'd you find us? Are you with Viridia? <laughs> that is unimportant. I'm here for your amulet. But this is just a worthless trinket. Obviously not. It most certainly is not, dear. You know full well what it is and what it does. Don't play coy with me, kitty cat. Here's what's going to happen. I get the amulet, you get to live. I leave you in peace and never bother you again. The Viridians should be here any moment. You're gonna stay here and greet them. If you don't follow these instructions, I will end Eskandar's life. I hope we have an agreement. Yes. I don't know how you know about Eskandar, but please, don't hurt him. I'll do as you ask. You are wise, Lady Kimre. You have my word. Now, about that amulet. Hey, wait a sec! We don't have to move forward right now if we choose to stay here in the jungle and find more goodies and slay more baddies. What? You do know the Imperial Army is probably on our tail, right? Uh, it'll be okay, pretty boy. See that blue flag? Go there if you want to repeat that part of the world. Who knows what we'll find in there? Noted. Now, about that hurrying up thing we need to do. <laughs> and that is to tell you that you can... WMLS Jungle, optional repeat. You can play it again. These others we can't, for obvious reasons. But, uh, you can replay the WMLS Jungle and get more EXP, basically. More EXP, find the treasures that you missed things like that. I think that's really cool. That's a really nice option to have. El Saga Caverns is next, where that just all went down, but first... So, uh, doesn't have anything more to say. Ingrid's gonna keep eating. So, the conversations haven't changed because we haven't gone to, uh, a new area. But what I can do <laughs> is I can buy coal. Leather strips and linen thread in case I want to make something. The rest I'm feeling okay with. Question is here's the question of the day. Um. Still that, uh, 29 <laughs> capacity. Eh. Soha could, could wear more. What do you think she uses? Or would be best using, I should say. Not even that. What do you think we should put on her? Because, again, you have choices. She has 43 capacity. Definitely not the stuff Lucian's wearing. He's got the heavy armor. For sure. Um. If. We gave her a male. What does she not have? Does she have an item on each? Yes. I want to try. Let's go male, Curse. Not leather. 
Let's go mail. Iron. Uh, blah, blah. No, we want wood. Flexible mail armor. Not coal. That would make steel. Steel mail. Let's go with that. Let's give her a sapphire fragment, which provides int. Let's go with this. Tick, 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 tick. Powerful steel mail. That is heavier than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> she can wear it, though. It's not that much more heavy than the, than the dress. It also, it lowers her evasion and her wisdom. Doesn't even up her... Up her, uh... Her int. Because I guess this, uh, regal dress is giving her some intelligence. It does give her a bit more strength and dex. A little more HP. It gives her more armor, which is really what I... What I want. So we'll do that. Though for future... Those of you maybe playing along, that regal dress is pretty good. Probably, probably cloth armor, even though it wouldn't give as much defense for Soha. Maybe if you were going more of a uh, casting route, may have more int and cloth items. Anyway. We have a, just a tiny bit of time left in this episode. Why don't we start the El Saga Caverns? Move the mouse off. What the? This is El Saga Caverns? Yeah. I was expecting a fight, but... Oh no! They've all been assassinated. These wounds are fresh. Blood is warm. There's no way the Viridian army could have beat us here. Fishy business. Indeed. We know what happened, but they don't. Jim, he took this whole place out. And then it gets hot. Does this take damage? No? Okay. Figured you might. Oh no, because you heal. Wiped this place out, didn't he or she? Well, in the five of diamonds, in the words of the uh, assassin, kitty cat still around? Yep. Hey, kitty cat. Although everybody called her lady. So she's got the respect of people. Lucia, she's paralyzed with fear. Be delicate. Are you Kira? Yes. You are you are a Viridia? Well, that's what the insignia on my armor says anyway. We're not gonna hurt you, but we have a lot to talk about. What would we have to discuss? What? Really? You mean to tell me you don't know who I am? Kira, please. We're just looking for information. I know you're not lying to us, but we need your help. Looks like we could help each other. I'm not going to tell you anything about the rebellion. You may as well kill me now. Oh man. That's bad. So what now? <laughs> Aha. I thought you'd be here, Lucian. 
Yeah. Jig is up, huh? Jig is up indeed, but not like you'd think. Don't worry, we know everything. I've been talking with your father about this whole mess, with the accusations of your treason. All rubbish. I'm wondering, though, how did you manage to break into this place and wipe out the rebels so quickly? I mean, well done! We were prepared for an ugly fight. Wasn't us. I was thinking it was actually your work. Really? Hmm. Huh. What about you, Beric Tor Renegade? Who did this? She's really shaken, Alexi. He probably won't get any answers here. It seems so. Well, no matter. The more important news is that you, Lucian, and your party have crippled the Belladorn Rebellion, and Viridia is prepared to do its best to exonerate you. All of you. Really? It's just that easy? I completely understand. Why take my word at face value? However, I have received personal orders from Duke Aldor. You can see them right here. He's waiting for you at Fort Albador, and we're finally going to put an end to this mess. Uh, this is definitely authentic. You see, Ingrid? Mr. Patriot isn't so foolish after all. I can't believe I doubted my father for a second. I am wrong on occasion. Alright, Alexi. We'll head to the fort. We'll all go together. We need to interrogate her. The trip back might be full of ambushes. Keep your wits about you. Come, let's get out of this backwoods hell and go home, Lucian. Quest complete for love of country. And that's that. You can still go back to the Women Last Jungle. And there's the fort. So there we go. Everything's going to be just fine, right? Ha. 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 Hmm. Hmm. Somehow, I don't think it's going to be that easy. But we'll have to figure out what happens next time. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you had a lot of fun. Until the next episode where we'll head to the fort, I'm Cinderay9. Remember to shoot for the stars and... Take care, everyone.